not John the Methodist or John the Presbyterian, <laughs> but John the Baptist. Um, many Bible scholars would think that his ministry uh, might have been as short as six months. One of only three lifelong Nazarites, if you want to know the law of the, the Nazarite, go to Numbers, Book of Numbers in the Bible, chapter 6. Um, when you think about it, Samuel, uh, Samson, and the only one in the New Testament, lifelong Nazarite, was John the Baptist. Uh, Matthew chapter 3, verse 3, coming in the spirit of Elijah, prepare ye the way of the Lord. Um, talking just today about the importance of preparation, the importance of getting ready. Uh, this week uh, is Mission Cedar Hill. In fact, you can kind of see the shirt insignia wear today. Mission Cedar Hill taking care of the community. It's big week. Uh, we're actually scheduled uh, to do work days, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, God willing, weather permitting. A uh, big celebration on Sunday at Crawford Park, 10 o'clock. Uh, praise in the park. We'll celebrate uh, the victories won at our junior camp and also Mission Cedar Hill. Um, but I just want to talk about the importance of preparation. Uh, someone asked me about doing something, um, and it's going to be, you know, 12 hour days uh, every day this week, even before we begin to work. We have to get ready, we have to prepare. The clerical things, putting together first aid kits, ice chests, and coolers. Uh, gathering equipment, delivering stuff. I mean, it's just unbelievable. We're dealing with volunteers, which is good, but it's just a lot. So just think about the importance of preparation for any good work, and especially uh, for the work of the Lord. Uh, may the good Lord strengthen our hands for the work that lies before us, the ministry of preparation. God bless you. Have a good evening.